Why they lying on my name, on my soul? I can't lose control when you do the most. What's my hope? I can't lose my soul. I can't lose no more. Alright y'all, what is going on guys? And today we're back with another banger video. And in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we do have my entire cap collection, fitted beanies, any, any type of hat, any type of accessory that goes on your head, we're gonna get into. We got a bunch of fitteds, we got a bunch of beanies, we got a bunch of stuff. So yes, I've done a fitted collection before on the second channel, which is why you gotta be subscribed to the second channel. Link in description to the second channel. I've got a couple fitted since then. Um, I've sold the fitted since then. Uh, we got a bunch of beanies that you guys probably haven't seen, a bunch of other like type of things. And yeah, so if you're new to the channel, just hit that subscribe button because we post Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday, four times a week, which is probably better than your favorite YouTuber. Unless, of course, I'm your favorite YouTuber. Now, go follow me on Instagram at paul.souls because I pretty much try to wear a hat or like an accessory in general, just like in every type of fit. So you normally see me with a hat all the time. So if you're following me on Instagram um, and if you're just continuously watching the vids, continuously, continuously watching the vids, you would probably see half of these hats. So get into it. I'm actually uh, excited to do this. Haven't done this in a couple months. Boom, fitted in beanies, yes sir. Off, we're gonna go through basically all the, the fitteds. We're gonna go through the fitteds and just like those type of hats. Then we'll get into more beanies and other type of hats that I have. So let's get into it. Starting off, I'm actually gonna do the one that's on my head right now. We got this uh, tan one. It is from Cap USA Harlem. I know I'm gonna get a lot of questions. Where do I get my fitteds? I get most of them from Cap USA Harlem or Lids. Again, I'm gonna tell you where I get everything. I get up to the hat, I'll tell you where I get the hat. So this is from Cap USA Harlem. Um, it's got the 2000, what, 1998 patch, I think. I don't know, I can't remember off the top of my head. It's got a big apple right here. It's got a red brim. So yeah, one of my favorite hats in my opinion. Like this is probably my, uh, yeah, this is probably my one of my go-tos. Like this is, it's just like a neutral color. It's like tan. I like the way that it looks with a lot of my fits. So yeah, you probably see me wear this one a lot, especially in videos too, which is something I like to throw on. Getting into probably the most worn fitted, um, since we were just talking about that, it is this navy one. This is navy. Uh, it's got a gray brim, um, apple on the back, Statue of Liberty patch, that new era fitted boom. This one is a seven one fourth. You're gonna see I go from seven one fourth, seven three eighth, and seven and a half is like my biggest one, just because. Um, with my hair, like my hair growing and I don't have hair. Like right now, this one's a little bit big on me because it's a seven three eighths. And when I don't have hair, cause I shave my head obviously, um, I'd be wearing like my seven one fourth. So this has been my go-to for the past couple months in case y'all haven't seen. But when my hair starts growing in, you're probably gonna see like more seven three eighths get worn and all that stuff. So yeah, first one, navy one. This one's from Lids, or this one's from Fanatics. This one was from Fanatics. I got this one a minute ago. Like before everybody started getting the ones with the apples on it and the, the like I got that so long ago. This right here is an Angels. This is the only, actually I have two non New York fitteds. I'm from New York, obviously. Um, but yeah, this is the only non New York uh, fitted I have besides one other one which we'll get into this one has 2002 on the side the year that I was born so I just liked it and I didn't have a red fitted uh, it's got a pink brim so it is a pinky and yeah I felt like it was just it was just a good pickup this again is from Cap USA Harlem next we got one from lids this right here is just a normal green fitted with a gray brim um something about like like I don't know I like I love the colored brims but I feel like you just can't you can't go wrong with a gray brim like the gray just goes like with everything and I just really like the way gray brims look but on the side right here, we got embroidered um, at lids, which again, you can get your hats embroidered at lids. Miss, Mr. Souls, and Leanne has a matching one that says Mrs. Souls, which she actually lost her hat. So, hey, that, she lost her hat. So we, we're gonna have to get her a new one. But yeah, it's like this olive green color. I really like it. I put the orange hint with it. And I feel like it complements each other very well. So yeah, another New York one. Another one from Lids. I think the last one from Lids, a very recent pickup, which if you guys watched the hour long vlog, you would have saw this one. Uh, me and Will went into Lids. We went into Lids and I wasn't gonna buy it fitted. Like I got enough fitteds I don't really need. There's like a few colors I still want just to like, you know, go with every type of fit. But I don't have a brown. And I was like, I have this cream one, you know, that's a neutral type color, but I wanted a brown for like a minute. And I go into lids and this is the one brown left and it's in my size. It's a seven, three, eight and um, gray brim. And then we got Leanne stitched on the back right here. So when I wear it backwards, you could see that Leanne on the, on the back of the hat. So. Yeah, this is, this is easily one of my new favorite fitteds, and this will probably become one of the most worn fitteds, like this one and like the navy one. So, yeah, can't wait to start taking fit pics in this. Maybe, maybe soon, maybe this week. Uh, go follow me on Instagram at pull.souls. Next, uh, we got probably a lot of people's favorite in my collection. It is this uh, Carolina blue one. Uh, it's got the patch on the side right there. This is from Cap USA Harlem. Got that on the back, got the apple on the back, got this Statue of Liberty right there, and then that pink brim you can't go wrong with a pinky um i surprisingly do not have any of the, of the icy brims like the blue brims um do it wait do it no i don't have i don't have a blue brim um i only have like the pink the red the gray 
yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Right here, this is the other non-New York one. I didn't have a yellow fitted, and I needed a yellow fitted for a fit that I wanted to do. And this one just looked really cool again from Cap USA Harlem. Again, they be supplying, so shout out to my boys. But uh, yeah, World Series on the side. Uh, what year was it? 1992. And uh, boom, red brim. Red brim with the yellow. I, hey, I thought it was a cool little mixture. The Toronto logo, you know. Shout out my, shout out my Toronto gang, you know. Shout out to y'all. Two fitteds that I've probably had for three years now. You know, a minute now. Um, this right here is just literally an all blue. It's literally got a blue brim, like no changing color. I don't remember the last time I've worn this. This is a 7 1 4th, and yeah, it's just a whatever. Like, I feel like I can make it look cool uh, with some fits, um, but I gotta put like patches on it or something, or like maybe get a stitch, but I don't know. The blue with the blue, it's not really doing it for me. And then same thing with this. Um, you know, this this was my first fitted like um, like years ago. Like you know, I just used to wear this like every day. If you, if you knew me in high school, I literally wore this every single day in high school. It's literally just a like regular new era navy Yankee hat. Now, when you turn it over, oh my god, oh my god! If you know, you know. I'm not even gonna say anything. You just know that hat does not get worn. That was pretty much all the fitteds. Now I did have a black fitted with a pink brim. It was literally this exact hat. I had this exact hat, but it was black. So it basically looked like this, you know, this is navy, but it was black. This right here, this right here, and it had a patch on the side. I don't remember, some World Series patch, it was like pink, and it had a pink brim. And I love that hat, that hat was cool. But I don't know, something about it, it just didn't fit my head like the rest. Like, I don't know if the size was maybe a little bit off. Like, it was a 7 one fourth. So I put it up on eBay to sell. Like, I was just like, you know what, I don't need it. I'd rather just put it towards the fitted I'm actually going to wear. Because I want to be able to wear all my fitteds. Like, I want, you know, for different types of fits, like different type of outfits. And uh, yeah, this, the, the black one with the pink brim, like, I loved it. But I just never wore it because I didn't like the way it looked on me. So I put it on eBay and somebody, shout out to my subscribers, you know, shout out uh, the person that bought the fitted, a longtime supporter. Uh, bought it and was like, can you sign the brim for me? So I never I, I never signed a brim, so I had to sign a pink brim. I was like, I don't want to ruin it, are you sure? They are like, no, like I'm literally not going to wear it. Like I want you to just sign it. So I, I wound up signing a pink brim. So uh, yeah, that was uh, different. Getting into just like normal kind of hats, just regular hats. We got this right here. This is an 8th Wonder uh, snapback. They sent this over, so appreciate them for that. So shout out to 8th Wonder right here. Definitely got to wear that soon. Then for my boy United Jewels Clothing, uh, send over a bunch of these hats. Um, shout out to him. We got the Coco Mango Chetty on the side. Boom, right there. Uh, got the NYC cards in general. And then you got, yeah, this is just tough. I really like this. And you got this one that says, cut from a different cloth. And it says morals, integrity, da 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 da. All that stuff is so fire. So shout out to him for giving these to me. Um, you know, go follow his Instagram. I'll put it up on the screen while I'm talking. But these are so tough. So yeah, it is a snapback. And I don't really wear snapbacks like that. But something about, like, these are just hitting different. So, yeah, this one is an all-reflective one. I took a fit pick in this, and I thought, this is a super tough snapback. So, I really mess with these. And, uh, yeah, can't really go wrong with them. Shout out to United Jewels Clothing. Last and final uh, hat besides, like, beanies and stuff is this right here. This is a Puma Big Sean collab hat. I bet y'all forgot that I even had this. I bet y'all forgot I even had this. In case you don't know, my favorite material is corduroy. And um, this is an all over corduroy green hat. This matched my book bag, which sadly got ruined. But uh, yeah, I had the book bag for it too. I had a sling bag. I think I still have the sling bag. And uh, yeah, I just really like this. So yeah, it's just a green like dad type hat. I haven't really worn it. I don't think I ever, I wore it like a couple times, but I never took like a fit in it or anything. So yeah, it's still a cool hat though. I like it. I have big Sean. Now getting into the last and final hats. So this right here is a bucket hat. Um, this is a Nike bucket hat. If you remember, at the, I did a Soho vlog um, back in like, I don't know when that was. It was it was like a year ago by now. But uh, yeah, I took a fit pick in this. I have like the matching shorts for it. It's like this flight thing. Pretty cool. It's just, just a bucket hat. Nothing, nothing too crazy. Another piece that 8th Wonder actually did send over. So huge shout out to 8th Wonder again. But it is this beanie. It's got the little little eight ball on it with the he's skating and it's really cool. I have actually have a, I didn't plan this or anything, but like I literally have, I'm wearing one of the t-shirts because I just mess with the tees like they're just tough. So huge shout out to my boys at Eighth Wonder for sending this over. I really do mess with the brand. Toronto Raptors one. I don't think I've ever worn this. I had a Bulls one too. I don't know where it is, but yeah, just just black beanie new era. Here's one of my favorite beanies. Um, like because I don't really wear beanies like that, but if I do, like this is a go-to. It's like it's kind of like the same color as the hat. It's like more of the like, neutrally like tans and stuff. So yeah, I think this is from like forever 21 or something like nothing crazy so beanie we have is um this i actually have two of these this and then the blue ones which is my own beanie that we made with 5 a.m hustle this is the brown colorway got soles on the side 5 a.m hustle on the back 
Boom, boom, boom. Huge shout out to Five and Hustle. We sold out of these, so I appreciate everybody that copped one of these. Uh, this and the blue one. Um, my blue one, Leanne has at the moment, so I don't have it with me, but just know we have both colorways. Obviously, it's my own beanie. Like, I need this for the Five and Hustle. So, soles on the side, Five and Hustle on the back, Yankee logo on the front, front all embroidered. So, shout out to everybody that copped. Um, for everybody asking me when like their package is arriving, I think Five and Hustle shipped them all out, so they should be there within the next week. Getting into the final two hats that we have is this ski mask right here. Boom, ski mask boys. We got this blue one. Uh, if you guys remember, like a year ago, we supplied the whole gang with ski masks. We all had a different color. We looked like a bunch of Skittles, but yeah, this is a cool little ski mask. I actually like wearing it as a beanie. Like it's probably one of my favorite beanies. Like I, obviously, I'm never gonna wear it like this. I took a fit pick in it like this, but other than that, like I'm not gonna be walking around with a ski mask. Like, but I like when it's rolled up into a beanie. Like I like the way that it fits the thickness of it and yeah very good winter winter piece last thing uh right here is from imran potato this right here is i guess we could call it a ski mask um yeah this is from imran potato shout out to my boy imran uh he be doing crazy stuff if you don't follow him on instagram just like the stuff that he drops like you guys have seen i have the crab slides i have the i had the lobster shoes i had like a i have a bunch of things from him so yeah this is just dope it's like just look at it it's so i took a fit pick in this as well on the instagram again i pulled out souls but yeah now i do have one more hat coming in and um it's it's not a beanie but i don't want to spoil it but like just know i'm gonna have a pickups haul very very soon and i'm just waiting for those packages to come in because i went i went a little crazy on grailed and i got this like it's like a designer type it's not a beanie but i don't know how to explain it. it's just like it's like a cap type thing it's like i don't know just just look out for the videos but that sadly couldn't be in it but uh yeah that was my entire cap fitted uh, beanie like any head accessory, you know just the hats in general So yeah, if you guys made it this far into the video make sure you smash that like button Let's get 300 likes on this video and I'll catch you in the next one. We out